Hey guys, welcome to Crazy Days. I'm Wanda, and today I'm drinking a little pumpkin spice from Ticino and trying to get some white sweet potatoes canned. So I thought I would give you a few little canning tips from Wanda's Kitchen. First things first, I make some hot soapy water. I put my jars in here, and these are new jars. I have from Full Circle this sponge that I've been using for almost two years. And the head is replaceable. If you need new ones, you can replace them. I have a couple in storage just in case. But these things are wonderful. You get it wet first. Don't try to put it in there when it's dry. When it's wet, it goes down in there. You clean the bottoms, you clean the sides, you can clean all around. And I do that mainly because of the um, it just coming from a store but if you have jars older jars I do the same way I put in here and use my full circle that's the way I clean things once I get my jars rinsed in hot water I turn them over here I will put a pan here and put boiling water or semi boiling water in it and lay these jars in it to keep them hot just before I pack them I've got my lids here we don't remember we don't don't put them in hot water anymore I've got same as with regular sweet potatoes we're gonna have a syrup a light syrup four cups of water to one cup of sugar and there's about three quarts and three cups of sugar in that got the canner going and cutting up potatoes and it looks like regular potatoes right but the sweet potatoes, some of them were white, some of them were pink. Danny and I have tried them, not noticed any difference in taste whatsoever. So I'm just going to cut them all up. I peeled them, I'm cutting them up, and we're going to can them just like we do regular sweet potatoes. So guys, these are some of the sweet potatoes that I've had that I've canned over the years. These are in Wide Mouse, done in 19. And you see they have kind of a milky look to them. That's okay. That is the starch coming out. Different potatoes, different ways they do. These were done in 20. And you see they're not as milky and stay kind of like that. They're looking really nice. These have a semi-milky look done in 18. So they're not as milky as the ones done in 19. So it would be a difference in potatoes, and I do wide mouth, and I do regular mouth. So it's one of each one. So you see, different potatoes will look different. So don't throw those potatoes out just because they have this, this look. It doesn't matter. That's the starch. These just had more starch. I might have done those when they were really fresh, as opposed to these may have been cured for several weeks. So it would be, it would make a difference in your potatoes when you can them. So I've got my cup of pumpkin spice. I'm going to be working on these potatoes and you can white sweet potatoes, just like you do uh, the red sweet potatoes, an hour and a half at 10 pounds of pressure here where I live. And you just use a light syrup. I'll use them in a multitude of ways. I, I have several ways in my cookbook that I've use sweet potatoes you can use the white ones just like you can the red ones just that know that they are not as sweet um we made like latkes we shredded the white sweet potatoes they don't have the starch that a regular irish potato or white potato would and they're sweet potatoes and we cooked those and they were awesome we love the latkes and probably going to have some of those for supper so guys Cook your white sweet potatoes just like you would your regular. Just know that they're not as sweet. Um, we make fries, things like that. And that's my tips for today. Don't throw those potatoes out. Hang on to them, check them, and make sure they're good in jars like I showed you. And we'll talk to you later. Thank you from Crazy Days.